Email is the number one way of exchanging CAD files with others. The best way to package our drawings for email is by using the eTransmit command. eTransmit can take everything that is contained or attached to our drawing and place it in a single zip file ready to be sent to our client. Let's take a look at eTransmit. I'm going to come up and open a drawing. I'm going to click my open icon. We're going to come down to our chapter 16 folder located inside our exercise files directory. Let me select the number two drawing, Topo Survey, and I'll click open. Now I need to send this drawing to a surveyor for their review. Instead of sending a DWG, I'm going to eTransmit this file. eTransmit will allow me to package this drawing and anything that is attached to this drawing into a single small zip file. To launch the eTransmit command, I'm going to come up to my file pull down and I'm going to select eTransmit. This brings up my Create Transmittal dialog box. On the left side, I can see my current drawing. This happens to be 02 Topo Survey. I can also see anything that happens to be attached to this drawing. Now, there's not much included with this file, but in AutoCAD we could have images. We could also have other drawings attached to this drawing. Everything would be included in this list. Now, if I'd like to add an additional file to this transmittal, I can come down and click the Add File button. If I click this, I can navigate my hard drive and I can select any other file or document that I would like to add to this submittal. Maybe I have an Excel document I'd like to send. Maybe I have a Word document or a PowerPoint. Any one of those files I can select and include in this transmittal. Just for fun, we'll grab another drawing. We'll include this drawing in our transmittal. Let me highlight that drawing and I'll come over and click Open. He is now a user added file. If I come down a little lower, I can add notes to my transmittal package. Let's type a note. When I'm all done selecting my files and adding my notes, I can come over and click my View Report button to see a copy of the text file that's going to be included in the transmittal. When my client receives their zip file, they can review this TXT file and see what was included in the transmittal. If I pan down, I can see all the information I need to know about this particular package. Let me click Close. At this point, I'm going to come over and click OK. I want to create my transmittal. When I do, AutoCAD is going to bring up a dialog and allow me to save this zip file on my network. I'm going to accept the name that AutoCAD's given this file, and I'll click Save. If I look at my command line, I can see that my transmittal zip file was successfully created. This file is now ready to be emailed to my surveyor. By e-transmitting our drawings, we can be assured that our client is getting everything related to our AutoCAD file, from pen tables to images to references, and everything is being sent using the smallest possible file size.